All right, everyone. It is 12.16 at night, and Kirsten, my traveling companion, who you all love on the internet, in Las Vegas, has said, fuck this shit, it's time for sleep. And you know what I said? We only just get started, baby! So, uh, let's, uh, continue our Las Vegas journey. I'm gonna take you on a random ass night in Vegas. I gotta get up at 9.30 in the morning for Pawn Stars. Come along with me. 12.17 at night. We're leaving the Flamingo. Where we go? Nobody knows! And I was just some tiki bar getting really drunk, so uh, I took $400 with me, so if I lose it, no big deal! Caesar's points. They're a thing. Get them. Get them! Get them! Hey, look, the uh, wine and spirits bar is still open. Well, the wine and spirits store um, is still open, but if you gamble, they get it for free. So what they do is they mark up everything here. So it's like, actually, that's not bad. Five bucks for a can of Truly, not for March Madness. You know, don't hate, appreciate. But we went to 7-Eleven last night and got a lot. Also, it's a... Uh, 12, 18 in the morning, and Starbucks is still wide open here at the Flamingo. I think that's the important thing to see is that Starbucks, wide open at the Flamingo, and fortunately it's a Friday night and no one seems to be checking in for the reservation at the Flamingo. I am a uh, Caesars Diamond member, and I actually have a key at home for this. Uh, earning period. I have a key to see if I can get in at my local Caesars property. That's all I'm saying. Hey, look, I'm walking through the casino now. Between you and me, I just want to get some White Castle. I don't know what's going on. This is a night in Vegas, a random ass night in Vegas. Look, there's even like a random street performer. Let's go out in front of the Flamingo and let's see. I don't think this is going to be any copyright issues. What the hell is going on here? This is awful. This is awful. This is awful. Wow. It's Spanish music. Back into the flamingo. I don't hate Spanish music. I just think that's awful. That's the flamingo. We're gonna go to Harrah's. We're gonna go everywhere. I'm gonna take you along until my glasses die in one clip. Good luck. Right, so I am back to playing roulette before I go to uh, get some. Uh, uh, White Castle. This person doesn't like White Castle. Again, the first night I was out late. The second night I was out late with Kirsten. And this is the third night for me in Vegas. So, uh, we got $80 on the table. That's a big friggin' number. I think I got $300 in the machine. $80 total on the table. We just need to land on something between $1 and $24. 22 is a good number. Hey, you bet just bought some White Castle. $120 win right there. $322. And then move this shit back down to $2.50 each after that $320 win. That's going to buy White Castle for sure. That's all I can say. And I got this old ass $20 bill that no slot machine will accept. I mean, I believe it's legitimate. Uh, I mean, if I try, I put it in. It just puts it back out. I got this from one of those machines that gives you the money back. Uh, I need right now, I've got $80 on the table. Uh, I need anything one, one through 24. 27 is no good. Oof. All right, we're about to risk it all. Get you in the next clip, come on. There's a lot of money on the table here. That's all I'm saying. All right, so my uh, total bet is three hundred and twenty dollars. What? Um, boys. Uh, one, one through twenty-four. You're about to see either a massive win or a massive lose on a three hundred and twenty-dollar bet. I have sixty-two percent chance of hitting it. Oh my God, that's a loss. Oof. Cashing out. 
That is a uh, rough catch out here. But sometimes the machine takes you down. It's going to hit on the next hand, but I couldn't go up to $640 times it was above the limit of the payout here. So just be aware, sometimes the machine gets you. It happens. You can't beat roulette. You can't beat roulette. Look, I made a lot more than that over the time, but there's times at uh, 12.36 of the morning that you just can't beat roulette. Caesar's Palace. Flamingo. These places were not built on winners. Casinos are not built on winners. But if you win a little bit over time, that is how you do it right. You know what is built on winners? Oh, White Castle. Uh, I took a couple hundred bucks with me. I didn't take anything crazy with me. Uh, but I wanted to show you kind of a night when you're like, eh, you know, you never know what'll happen. Maybe we'll make it back. Who knows? Stay tuned. We're going to White Castle now. I love me some White Castle. That's all I'm going to say. But yeah, that was a bad $360 run right there. But it happens. Other days you make $300. Say la vie. Say la vie. Welcome to Roulette. We have In N Out Burger here, which In N Out Burger is an option, but that's an option Kirsten likes. She does not like White Castle. So I'm not going to In N Out Burger. We're going further to the White Castle. All right, we're going to try our luck, or not luck, at the big wheel. Uh, we've got my Caesars card, and I'm going to give it a try at the big wheel. So the big wheel, the big wheel is a game kind of like roulette, but not like roulette at the same time. Uh, I'm going to hide tips. Essentially, you're just betting on where this big wheel in front of you falls. Again, I'm still off over the trip. Um, I'm a couple hundred bucks, even after taking out all expenses and everything. But I bet five dollars on the big wheel. If it lands on one, three, one, not eleven, not eleven. There we go. Boom. Made ten dollars there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna play roulette strategy on the big wheel. He just came to my thing and said, "Did you have a Malibu pineapple?" And uh, I said, "I will take a Malibu pineapple." I would generally order a Malibu Coke, but if she wants to come and go, did you have a Malibu pineapple? I said, yeah, leave her a $2 tip. Stop wheel. I'm the stop wheel buddy. I got 10 bucks on there. Again, you're watching this in real time. I like to show you a real time uh, bad night in Vegas. No, oh, come on. Oh, 11 again. Oof. Oof. I'm repeating double. That's a pretty good. It's a good drink. Malibu pineapple just comes to you. She goes, do you have a Malibu pineapple? Like, I would order a Malibu Coke, but Malibu pineapple? Big wheel. Watch the big wheel. Am I the only idiot playing the big wheel? Maybe. We'll see. Come on, one, one, one. Oh. Come on. Ridiculous. As the only idiot betting on the wheel. How am I doing? At least I have my card and I'm getting credits with Caesars. Oh, thank God. Really? That wheel is not fair. I'm gonna repeat and increase by one. So I make $60. I think that's what I put in this machine. But hey, look, at least I got my Malibu pineapple. Who the fuck orders a Malibu pineapple? That uh, U2 album in the morning o'clock, 12.43 in the morning o'clock in Vegas. Who the hell knows? Pretty good though. No, oh, finally, come on. Come on. Oh my God. Yeah, fuck this game. Literally, fuck this game. That's all I can say. No words. Fuck this game. So you saw some uh, rough times, but I've been playing this for a bit. So like 10 bucks here, I'm back up. I think I put 500 in the last one. And I'm just doing $10 each. It's probably about half an hour on this machine. And just Martin yelling up. Again, this is a, what the fuck is this? First nine, second nine, third nine, fourth nine? What the hell is this bet? 
I have not seen that. No results. Ball will be spun again. This is what happens when the ball is spun by compressed air. I've literally never seen first nine, second nine, third nine, fourth nine. Because I've just been playing red and black on a uh, Fibonacci, but I've gotten up from uh, oh yeah, 90 something dollars left to 395 playing on a Fibonacci. So uh, just be aware uh, it is possible. And fortunately, there's a uh, white castle on the other side. Yeah, I had a really bad run on the other machine, but uh, let's see if this is a better run. Yeah, that's a better run. And that's what happens. Right, so as weird as it sounds tonight, what's working for me is actually a uh, Fibonacci sequence. 1, 3, 5, 8, 13, 21, 34. I've not had to go above 34, but you just go up in your... I'm just playing red and black. I know. Or sods and whatever the hell is going on up here. 46.5% uh, with the house edge 5%. 45.5%, uh, let's be honest with you. Uh, but um, running a uh, Fibonacci on here has been working. It got me up from the $90 I had left before to $437. I've done built it back up. We're going to build back better. There we go. Another win. $16 up. Watch that $437 go to $453. Look at that. Hey, it's working. What was the last bet? $8. So we're going to go two, three, four, five. Again, let's go uh, up or down. We're, I'm just doing a little one sequence. Sometimes you go two, but I want to make money quicker. So if it's a win, you go down one. If it's a lose, you go. I'm doing this on a $1 machine. So you can literally start at $1, go up to $2,000. That's rare. I am at Casino Royale, which is, uh, what the hell is Casino Royale? Uh, that's bad. Casino Royale is in the best western. It's uh, directly to the uh, <laughs> to the Sahara, the north or so. So five, six, seven, eight of the Haras. But Haras is five dollars or three dollars. This is literally a dollar is the minimum here. So um, we can start. We can go up a lot more. We're at eight dollars. See where that goes. Again, we're at four forty. We've been climbing up. Went from ninety dollars all the way up to here. That's the important thing. Uh, in about 45 minutes or so. It's kind of degenerate and I love it so much. There's some side game here that you're never going to make money on because uh, casinos make money on side games, not you, unless you're trying to make points. It's working so far. Fibonacci. I played it from like $90 back up to $488 in like 45 minutes or so. I want to get it, I, I think I had four or 500 in. That was a bad run. Let's not lie. The last casino I'm in, I'm in the Best Western now. It's a lot better. I'm going to make that up to like 520. Then I'm going to go get some dinner snack over at, uh, what's that called? Uh, White Castle over there, which is on the other side of the slot machines. But uh, 488 plus 5. We're making it to 520. We'll call it a night. Rough night. Bank rolls a thing. But this one starts at a dollar. Stuff at... Uh, at uh, Caesars is five dollars or so. That is a win. I take that's a ten dollar win right there. That's all we're looking for. We need a couple more of those. See, four eighty eight goes to four ninety eight. Let's put another five dollars there and uh, get up to five. You know what? Let's, let's let's do eight. And now the numbers have gotten crazy again on this game. This is roulette. It's a hard game to beat. We're at fifty five dollars on a bet on red. We've not had a streak of black longer than four in a while. Again, it doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean anything. You could have a six streak. You could have anything like that. I'm just pointing out something. Five, six. We got a double again. It's a rough game. This is roulette. It's gambling. Done well so far. Thank God. There we go. $110 there on that win. We went to $477. Then we had a bad run. Let's start at like 20 bucks there. That's going to help us to solidify this a lot quicker. That's how I'm making so much so fast. Crazy bets. That's how you make so much so fast. But you understand the risk. That crazy bet paid off. Again, we were doing a Fibonacci. Let's just go with the... Uh, Six, seven, eight. Again, we'll go eight. We're at 489 plus eight. Again, I'm just trying to get over to my White Castle. Got to get that back up to 500. And I paid for my White Castle. Had a good time. Got some casino points. It's 
it's been an interesting night. That's all I'll say. But casino points are worth something. They're worth comps. They're worth coming to Vegas for free. They're worth not paying uh, hotel fees. They're worth not paying show fees. They're worth getting free rides on the big wheel stupid thing. You ever pay full price to ride on the high roller? Just sign up for Caesars Rewards Program. They give you at least buy one, get one free, if not better. I got $8 there, and that is a... I can't see a win. Yes. 49, there we go, that's 505. Just a little more to get White Castle. Here we go, we got our last bet from $90 down to $511. Plus, come on, if it hits red, we get that 525. If not, boom, 525. Please, give me my money, there we go, 525. Where's the cash out button? Cash out. That means I, uh, Made a lot of points, and here's the important thing. I got the losses at Caesars, which is my local casino, and I came over to Casino Royale, which is the best Western, and I won it all back. Caesars thinks I lost the money. They're gonna give me comps. They're gonna let me come to Vegas for free again. I made it all back, and got some White Castle. It's a rough night, but I'm gonna take you along for White Castle. I got 25 bucks in profit. I'm not gonna spend 25 bucks at White Castle because it's literally 2.11 in the morning. White Castle, 2.11, let's see what we get. All right, let's play a game of what the fuck. 24 hour White Castle's closed. I got 25 bucks. 24 hour White Castle has decided to close for the evening. 24 seven White Castle decided to close for the evening. Where are we going? Nobody knows. That's the fun part, I need something to eat. Hey look, uh, White Castle, as you saw, was close for cleaning, but Subway eat fresh. I gave, <laughs> I had a good run in the casino, so I'll give the tip in my bucket. I told her, cut it in either three or four, whatever the, uh, whatever the, the knife gods say. Look. It's a, uh, 2.15 a.m. It's IM BMT. They had an Ask Us sauce. Frank's barbecue sauce. From Frank's Red Hot. Mmm. Spicy barbecue. Yeah. That's pretty good. They're gonna wrap up this night of gambling. I literally have no idea what you've seen, what you've learned from here. But, hey. This is a night after everything ends. You go up, down, $90 up to $5.25. That's a night in Vegas. We're not done for the night. We're gonna try and speed up making some money. Again, we have to start a Fibonacci here at $3. But here, we can control it. So we're just betting red. The nope. winning number is 10. Black even. Black. Place oh, your bets. <laughs> five. Three, five, eight, 13, 21, 34. Oh. The winning number is 27 red odd. I put in 100 Place bucks. Place your bets. Well, I put in 100 bucks, but here, I don't have to wait for the wheel to stop. I can literally stop the, the wheel. The winning number is one red so, odd. That's how you can Place make a bets. lot more, a lot quicker. The winning number is 13 black odd. Add $2. Place your bets. There we go. Come on. There we go. The Number is 25 red on. Boom. Place your bets. $7. We, were, we got up to eight. Now we're at $120 in literally less than like a minute and a half. Uh, so we're going to step back down two steps to three. Red. The Boom. winning number is 32 red even. Repeat. Place your bets. There we go. Hey. The winning number hey, is it works. One. It works red until it doesn't. Well, Place your bets. The winning number is one red on. No, oh, it was. Place your bets. Well, this is a good run. There we go. The winning number is 33 black on. Place right your on. bets. That's all it is. The six. winning number is six black even. Ooh. Place your bets. So go up to eight. Whoa. The winning number is 20 black even. Welcome to. Place your bets. 13, come on. Oh. The winning number is. Last one, because the battery in the glasses is dying. 21. 
Oh. The winning number is 29 oh, black come on. odd. Hold on. Place your bets. 30. Four. Come on. Oh. The winning number is 31 black odd. Place Whoa. your bets. This is how it happens. And we gotta go up a little bit more. I've got it here. There we go. The next one is 55. 45, I need another 10 bucks. That's how it happens real quick. And you wind up back in a hole. Come on. Red. There we go. The winning number is Woo! two red even. Thank God. Place your bets. Come on. There we go. Back to the 200. Glorious. Uh, I want more. Because I like pain. Battery runs out. I put in 200. I'll take another 25 bucks. Come on. Oof. The winning number is two. Hold up. Black even. Place I your might bets. have to leave you in suspense if the battery dies. There we go. The winning number is 36. Is that, uh, what we got? Even. Two. Place your bets. 224. Oh, God. One more time. Quickly, quickly. Oh, God. The winning number is 20 black even. Come on. Place Let me see your 25. Oh, God. The winning number is 24 black even. I know Place these bets are really good. Oh, God. The winning number is four. This might have to be a will even. they, won't they Place scenario. Your bets. Come on. Will we get red? Yes, we did. The winning number oh, wait. is Plus 13. Yes. Come on, come on. Place Two. Your bets. 21. That's not good. Five dollars. Quickly, quickly. Oh God. The winning number is two. Repeat, Black even. And the night with our belly full. Up a bit. This is Richard from No Pants Profits from Eras Las Vegas saying, when you wear no pants, the only thing you're left to lose is your shirt. We went from $90 up to 500 and even made more. That's the way you do it in a night in Las Vegas. Bye. Love y'all. Don't lose your pants, or don't lose your shirt, whatever it is. Bye.